and your girl is back in full effect. Sorry for, you know, neglecting you all for a whole month and a couple of days. But it's all my fault because your girl just crazy. Okay, so y'all know, you know, if y'all, if somebody tell me, Trees, you want to um, do some overtime? I'm going to say yeah. So I just told the uh, receptionist girl, I said, look, don't ask me if I want to do some more overtime because I'm going to say yeah. And I can't do it anymore because my body just won't let me right now. I was working eight hours at my regular job. Then I would do four hours at another job. Then I would do two to three days of home visits. So, I was like, oh my goodness, this is too much. Then, I'm sitting here chilling, uploading a video that never uploaded. Sitting here, sipping on my wine, talking on the phone. Next thing I know, I hear something say, Psst, and the computer just shut off. Why the hell I spill wine on the computer? I was like, oh my God, what's going on? So, I had the fan on it for I don't know how long. Then I took it back to Best Buy, raising hell. Like, it just stopped working. I don't know what I, I don't, I didn't do nothing to it. It just stopped working. They're like, ma'am, we can't do nothing with this computer. It's something with the motherboard. Oh, no. Mm-mm-mm. Because I didn't do nothing wrong to this computer. It just stopped working. It's defected. Y'all need to give me a new computer. So I raised sand for a month. And your girl is back. Hey. But, oh, I hope nobody at Best Buy watching this. Oh, well. Anyway, so, yeah, that's that. And, um, yeah. So I didn't have a computer. The computer that I was using, I just didn't even go on YouTube. I was just, you know, in and out, in and out. But, needless to say, your girl is back in full effect. Oh, what is this video even about? I don't know. But, yeah. So, be expecting more videos to come. Um, I may show some footage of my Chicago trip that I had so much fun on and spent so much money. Oh, my goodness. I can't believe how much money I spent in Chicago. But, yeah. So, that's that. Oh, another thing. <laughs> Some people is just crazy. Even though I didn't have a computer, I can still get emails. And thanks to everybody who emailed me. You know, we was emailing back and forth and conversing and all of that. Checking in on me. That was really nice of you all. So, I really do appreciate that. And, um... Yeah, so I just wanted to let y'all know about the comments that I've been getting on some of my videos. It's just crazy how people can dislike you for nothing. What's your reasoning for not liking me? I never did nothing to you. What did I do to you? Nothing. If you don't like my personality, it's 50,000 other people on YouTube go holla at them because the negative comments calling me all type of bitches and hoes and you this and you that and I'm not going to tolerate it so you will be getting a response from me and you will be deleted I'm sorry I just can't do it then somebody was like I don't like you because you blink too much you sound real dumb. You sound real stupid. Then I had somebody tell me on a review video, a video I was doing a review on, Tracy, you're talking too much. Okay. Okay, I got you. But yeah, it's just been crazy. And I'm like, well, wow. Y'all childish. Some of y'all childish. But, yeah, so, it is. Okay, 
So, let me tell y'all about what happened last night. So, I was bored. And I was like, I need something to do. I really just need something to do. And I knew that Jill Scott and Maxwell was in town. So, I was like, maybe I should go. Maybe I shouldn't. Maybe I should go. Maybe I shouldn't. It's 5 o'clock. The concert started at 7. It's 5 o'clock. I jumped up, put on some clothes. I ain't got a damn ticket. I ain't got no ticket. I couldn't get online to do it because you cannot get tickets within a certain time frame or something like that. Couldn't get the ticket. So I called the palace the box office like, um, yeah, y'all still got some tickets? She was like, yeah, we got some left. Come on up here. So I went up to the palace, me and, um, somebody went up to the palace they had some tickets left but they were shitty tickets but i was like i don't care i just want to do something i just wanted to do something so you know we were sitting in some shitty seats but you know it was still you know the atmosphere we had our drinks and you know we were just sitting there so like 30 minutes into the show a usher came and he was like, let me see your tickets. So I'm thinking he just want to see our tickets to make sure we sitting in the right seats. And he was like, I have some better seats for you all here. So he gave us the tickets and took ours. So we like, okay, let's find our seat. So we got up, went downstairs trying to find where our seats at. So we like, okay, it's say 101. C, 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 where the hell is it? So we study walking down, walking down, walking down. We like, where is C, C? We see A, B, C, D, but where is C, C? Go down, down, down. We were three rows from the stage. Three rows from the stage. I just couldn't believe it. I said, oh my God, these seats were like a hundred dollars a piece and we sitting in them chilling like we be up here I'm like okay yeah hey Gia all right yeah uh-huh I just what the heck I was like oh my goodness three rows just a spur of the moment thing I was like come on let's go Somewhere we need to go somewhere because I'm I'm tired of sitting in this house Three rows and the tickets was forty dollars. I paid forty dollars for the tickets The shitty tickets and then we sat three rows from the stage What the heck? Where does that happen? I don't know. Oh my goodness. Ooh right place at the right time oh my goodness so i'll show you all so let me tell y'all about maxwell he put on a show he was all over that stage dancing and i'm tired of maxwell when he in the videos he just you know just there but he put on a show. I mean, he was dancing, grinding, and uh-huh. Okay, Maxwell. All right. I got you. If you send me a message on YouTube, I will be responding to you. Because you know I couldn't. But if you sent one to my email, I responded. But So, be expecting a response from me. If I owe you something... And you know who I'm talking to. If I owe you something, please, 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 be patient with me. Please. Because, you know, I'm just off track right now. So, I'll holler at y'all later. Oh,